today we're headed back to the Cobra Canal because turbo long tail boat racing is back in Bangkok. And this time I brought a friend with me. Most of you probably remember my friend Spoy from the Boost and Boobies in Bangkok video. You might know her as Ice Cream Girl. <laughs> Look at, look at ice cream. No, I'm not bringing ice cream for you. You didn't bring me any ice cream today. Yeah. Rude. Before we go on a boat ride, I have something to show you. What? So this is my boat. It's called the Titanic. Do you know the movie Titanic? Yeah. Jack and Lost. Yeah, you know. <laughs> you do know. Do you know what this engine is? No. It's from a Mazda RX-7. Are you, do you know? No. Yeah. <laughs> so once this is finished, we'll bring you out again and you can ride my Titanic. No. No? No. Why are you afraid? I cannot ride. You can. I cannot swim. It's okay. You don't need to swim. I think you can float. So I know you guys have been waiting on an update on the Titanic build for a long time because of what's going on here in the country of Thailand, you know, that whole Delta situation. Things have been delayed over and over and over again. But we are finally making progress, as you can see. The engine is on the boat, finally, but it's far from finished. We have a lot of things to do, including putting the clutch assembly in, propeller and the propeller shaft, installing the fuel tank, battery, wiring the standalone engine management system yes we have a legit full-blown waterproof standalone engine management system for this boat that has to be installed wired up and then it has to be tuned we're gonna be putting a base tune on it and then fine tuning it from there I guess you really don't street tune it would be a water tune but I'm super excited to make some progress get this boat finished get it on the water drive it myself go for some epic rides and then eventually give it away to one of you guys the Titanic build is finally making progress so you can see here this is the oem bell housing for the 13b and then this plate right here was completely custom fabricated to mount this this is where we will attach the propeller shaft which will go all the way back to the propeller see this is what the propeller shaft and the propeller looks like these are custom made like fully custom made and trust me they are not cheap so the propellers are actually handmade out of steel and it takes almost two weeks to make a single propeller. They make them depending on the amount of horsepower your boat has and the type of boat that you're running. So every single boat has a custom propeller for that particular boat. You can see on the boat that's next to mine, this one is using the traditional Azuzu 4JJ inline four turbo diesel. But you can see over here where they have the battery wired up and this right here is actually the fuel tank. So we need to complete this as well over here on my boat. I am so incredibly stoked to be back here at the Cobra Canal. And if you're stoked to see boat racing content on this channel once again, do me a personal favor, give this video a like. I'm doing a test. I wanna see how many likes this video gets versus the videos that I've done of my BMW E30. So if you enjoy boat racing content, do me a favor real quick. Give this video a like. This boat actually has, check this out, it has a 4AG out of a Toyota Corolla with ITVs. Check that out. Oh, that dude is getting it, son. Okay, this is not going to be as fast as some of the uh, turbocharged diesel boats, but really, I just want to hear that 4AG with those ITB scream. This is going to be a cool boat ride.
folks, but I tell you this, the way that thing sounds is just freaking cool, man. I've never heard an ITB 4AG with an exhaust pipe that's literally two feet long. It sounds sick. That boat that just went past us is actually a deep hole boat. Those are the ones that are actually made to go in the sea that will transfer people from the mainland to an island. My boat is meant for canals, but you can tell the difference by how deep the hole is. You doing a photo shoot? I cannot swim! <laughs> so, I was just on this boat, the one right here. Yeah. It's pretty quick, but the boat we're about to go on is a turbocharged diesel boat, and it's going to be much, much faster. Are you ready? She's not ready. Are you sure? <laughs> she does not look ready, but we're going to send it anyway. <laughs> now I promise you, she was telling me she wants to go skydiving with me. Skydiving is way more scarier. Pool number two or three. I can't remember which one. like this video and I'll catch you in another one one day. Peace.